thought to show you guys how you can soak your fruits. Um, basically, we did start the recipe a couple of weeks ago and a couple of days ago, I mean, sorry guys. And um, basically, I said to myself, well, we need to continue because there's a lot of people want to know how to soak their fruits. But tonight is the night, which we're going to show you. You know what I mean? They, they did request it and said to me that Chef Ricardo, we want you to show us how to sort the fruits. And I said to myself, there's no problem with that. I can always do that for you guys. So I go out the way and I get all of my ingredients because I know what to get and also what to do. Uh, basically, if you're in the local areas, I live in London, so if you're in the local area, you can go to one of these big supermarkets. You know, there's big brand supermarkets where you can get all of these things to buy, like Red Label Wine. Yes, the Red Label Wine is one of the most important thing. Also, and the Jamaican White Rum, Ray and Navy, is one of the next key one, which is good for you to have it, guys. But I'm saying, if you are in the local area in London, basically, I'm simply saying to you, you can go to any one of these local shop on Get it to buy that's the beauty um to be honest guys to make the jamaican rum fruit cake you know you need to soak your fruits um basically a lot of people did not sort their fruits but if you didn't log on on the show and you're just gonna log on on the show on basically we want to say welcome to chef ricardo cooking show guys there's amazing things going on tonight you know, the, you know the place the place hot tonight when i say hot 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 tonight gonna be Hot. yeah so log on and see what chef got after half to you guys tonight we're gonna show you all you can marinate oh sorry guys all you can soak your fruits and you know what i mean get it to use the next day or for christmas so there's a lot of things gonna happen tonight which guys i want you to please log on on the show and you know what i mean because i want to start the show to show you guys how to sort the fruit. So if you're not log on, please log on. We need you to to see exactly what Chef Ricardo gonna happen in the kitchen tonight. Um, <laughs> to be honest, I'm working with so many different things one time, but that's fine. We will reach there, guys. Basically, tonight is the night which we're gonna do the Christmas fruit soaking. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. We love you guys. <laughs> Merry Merry Christmas and a happy, happy, happy New Year. I don't know if you're happy, but you know what I mean? I'm happy because you know I mean? I'm going to sort the fruits tonight. We want to get the fruits out the way, guys, honestly. And I'm going to show you how to make the cake. Oh, that's, that's fair enough, is it? So, one more time again, welcome to Chef Ricardo Cooking Show. Um, I, I forgot my Christmas cap, but you know, and I'm, a, I'm a Christmas red jacket right here, so that's fine. But anyway, Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. Welcome back. If you if it's just log on, please log on and watch the show. We're going to show you how to soak the Christmas fruit cake tonight. And I know you guys are going to love it because you know what happened. Yes, Chef Ricardo is in the kitchen tonight. Well, I'm not in the kitchen. I'm in my office. So <laughs> I want to bring the, com the, br the computer into, my office, into the kitchen and we're going to cook live. All right. Anyway. Tonight is a night which is very important and um, a lot of people did ask for the recipe of how to soak the Christmas rum fruit cake and I did tell them already say I'm gonna do the recipe I'm gonna get the recipe done and dusted and put it out for you guys that so you guys can understand what's going on and exactly what to do for Christmas all right all right so this Christmas we're gonna soak the fruits yes we're gonna soak the fruits and um, um, tonight we're gonna, I'm gonna show you tonight how to sort the fruits, guys. And honestly, seriously, you know what I mean? You have to do this, guys. You have to, you know what I mean? Get your stuff and go to the shop and buy up your stuff and get your fruits. Soak. You get what I mean? Yes. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Because this is all of my ingredients. Right here. I got rum. This is a coconut rum, though. Coconut rum. Yeah? I got some dark rum. I got some white rum i got some red label wine if you if you are allergic to alcohol all right if you're allergic to alcohol don't worry yourself what I can do for you i can always go back myself again and get some fruits i always have fruit i got a lot of fruits you know what i mean 
and get the stuff for all to show you to make your Christmas cake without rum or without any alcohol. I can do that for you guys. So if you're allergic to alcohol, don't any feel any way, Chef Ricardo can fix that gap. So, do you ready to soak your fruits? Let Chef Ricardo know. Let Chef Ricardo know if you're ready to soak your fruits, guys, because tonight is a night which we have to we have to make the people and know that we're gonna sort the fruits tonight definitely tonight guys and you know what i mean it's it's just brilliant 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 idea for tonight um they asked me if can i do the show live of all to sort the fruits and i i did say yes so i say you know if i say something i like to do it you know what i mean i don't like to uh someone said to me say oh yes you say you're gonna do it and i didn't do it but you know what i mean i like to go there and do it guys so tonight we want to do this show live 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 tonight guys in the kitchen with chef ricardo i'm not in the kitchen i'm in my office at the moment but anyway i'm gonna show you how to soak your fruits your jamaican rum fruit cake if you missed the show remember the show gonna be on my youtube channel where you can always go back and watch it guys to show you, give you idea and tips and way how to soak your fruits. So don't feel any way I say, oh my days, I miss Chef Ricardo show, man. Oh my God, I forgot to you know, say you was gonna, um, no, 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 you don't need to worry yourself. It's gonna be on the YouTube channel and it's gonna show you how to soak the fruits and what to do. So we don't wanna go out of it, dry it out too much and you know what I mean? So I just wanna see, you know what I mean? A few people saying, yes, start, you know what I mean? Start soak the fruit, Chef Ricardo. And then we can start do what we have to do. You understand, guys? So, anyway, we want to start to sort the fruits in a bit. And hopefully, guys, you will see the video on the YouTube channel. And that's, you don't have any problem. And you don't have any stress. And say, boy, I miss Chef Ricardo when he was doing this. Uh, why he never did let me know. Okay? So, are you ready? I don't know. A few people have done. So, you know what I mean, hopefully, them, you know what I mean, they can see exactly what Chef Ricardo is all about. As I said, we're going to show you guys how to sort the fruits and how to, you know what I mean, put it in a sealed container like this one. This is my sealed container right here, guys. There's no fruits inside of it. Empty. All right? So, we're going to show you how to put fruits in it, put wine in it, and soak it. It's amazing. It is amazing. We start the we start the recipe the other day of talking about um, um, oh, are you soaking your fruit for Christmas? And you know what I mean? A few people were saying, Chef Ricardo, can I do the fruits? Um, so the fruits for me, show us how to do it live. So tonight is the night which we want to do this. All right? I don't know. I don't know. Um, basically, I don't know. What you are doing at the moment if you are in a kitchen cooking or or you know what i mean i don't know what exactly what you're doing at the moment but at the moment i'm right here want to start showing you guys how to soak your fruits and get it done and dusted all right that means this christmas your family gonna be happy everyone gonna be happy and i'm telling you you're gonna love this guys because it is a nice lovely recipe and i'm telling you trust me it's gonna be fantastic it, because the beauty with it to be honest with you guys in this package right here it got no not this one i'm sorry this one is mixed fruits every fruits what you can think of inside of this one the reason why i want to simply say to you all of the fruits in this one you can go to the local shop or the supermarket. Remember, I was telling you before. You can go to the local shop. Uh, this one is some raisin. You know what I mean? Raisin. Um, basically, I get this one. This is a 500 gram. Um, and this one, let me see how much, how much in this one. Um, this is a 150 gram. So, it's not like, it's a really, I'm just want to show you guys how to fill a buck like this. How to soak your fruits and... <coughs> Or to get it done and dusted. Yes, I've got some. This is some dark rum, and this one is some coconut rum. Brilliant. Um, so we want to start to show you guys how we're gonna sort the fruits. 
and you know what I mean if you missed the show please log on and the YouTube channel and go and leave your comments and watch it and you know what I mean you can tell your friend your neighbor your sister your uncle how to sow fruits for Christmas guys and that's, you understand so it's just it's basic recipe simple effective though but you know chef record are gonna do it good so we appreciate one who log on so far if you never log on on my show before welcome to my show if you never subscribe to the YouTube channel please guys don't miss anything you know what I mean guys if you miss anything you're not gonna see it with chef recorder live you're gonna see it on the YouTube channel so you need to on the YouTube channel subscribe to the channel don't miss anything because you know when chef recorder do his work and do his work <laughs> no time to back up guys so this is the way oh, it goes tonight we want to do some live 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 scene of how to soak your fruits at home your christmas fruits your jamaican rum fruit cake different different yeah let me talk some pata pat, patwa yeah different fruit cake we have to talk about or you're gonna sort the fruits and the fruits are gonna come out one thing I want to simply say to you, I heard someone was, I was doing an interview with someone a couple of months ago and then said, Jamaican food is one of the most sexiest food ever exists. Um, I, I said to myself, trust me, he's right. Jamaican food is one of the most sexiest food ever, 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 ever exists in this whole entire world. I don't matter where you're from, who you are, but Jamaican food is one of the most sexiest food ever exists. And I'm telling you the reason why I'm not because the, you know what I mean when he when he talk it, I said to myself, he's right. That's the only thing I could say. He is right. Jamaican food is one of the top lists at the moment. A lot of people love Jamaican food. I'm telling you, anywhere in London you go, and you know what I mean, if a Jamaican did it, it now go on with nothing. Serious thing. Anywhere in a London, something is going on. If a Jamaican did it, it not going on with nothing. So, Jamaican, big up on yourself. We love you guys. <laughs> All of our respect and joy and everything. You understand? So, listen, what may I say? Not because I'm from Jamaica, you know what I mean? I'm a chef, I cook, cook all the time and I do all over the whole place. I do sort of cooking. And, but I'm saying, Jamaican, you know what I mean? We, we, we just put our things out there, man. We just do things, man, and things happen. Get what I mean? When they're talking about Jamaican jerk chicken, is one of the most top lists right now over the whole wide world. Christmas is coming up. How much people still gonna be needing jerk chicken? How much people gonna make in jerk chicken? Same way. I know it's a Christmas roast dinner and all that thing, but Christmas, every time people always doing stuff and, you know what I mean? Jamaican have to involve in it. Yes. Yes. Jamaica is a must because we are on top of the list for everything in the world. Anyway, tonight we're going to show you how to marinate, how to soak your fruits. Not to marinate, I keep talking about marinate. I'm, talking, I'm not soaking, no, I'm not marinating no chicken no, or no beef or no lamb. <laughs> so, so, yes. Tonight we want to talk about how to soak your fruits at home. You understand? How to soak your fruits at home? Do you know how to soak your fruits? Log on on the show and let Chef Ricardo know because a whole lot of things are going on right now in the kitchen and the kitchen are run hot. You know what I mean? Everything I run hot, everything I get burned up, everything on a fire. So, um, right now, right now we're going to start to show you guys how to soak the fruits. You know what I mean? No time for each, no time to say, okay. We're gonna wait till next week or next month. No. You understand? We wanna start the show off how to soak your Jamaican rum fruit cake. I got all of my ingredients right here. And I wanna say to you guys, please, 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 let's go into business. Yeah, we're gonna go into some serious thing now. And is the way how to soak your fruits? That's what we are talking about. Exactly, how to soak your fruits. So, do you got any fruits fruits at home where you buy or you start to soak your fruits already? I don't know. 
if you start to soak your fruits already, that's that's really nice and good. I'm, I'm happy for that. So, what about red label wine, the Jamaican rum, and um and also some <laughs> some some dark rum, some coconut rum, and all them thing there. Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean. Um, yes. Yeah, so right now we wanna start to show you guys how to soak your fruits, and you know what I mean. It's amazing. It is a amazing, 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 amazing. Um, you know what I mean. It's just brilliant at the moment. So. Um, what well, I doesn't say to you, you know what I mean? A few people like that, but I, I want to start to show you guys how to sort of fruits, but, you know what I mean? Um, I, 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 I believe, I believe that tonight is the night which we're going to show you guys how to sort the fruits. It is brilliant. I got every ingredient right here with me just to show you how to soak your fruits. And I'm telling you guys, you're gonna love it. You know what I mean? We got remember now. <laughs> this is this is amazing thing happening right now. This is amazing thing. This this place is getting hot and hotter and hotter and hotter and hotter. I got all of my ingredients. I got everything. White rum, dark rum, red label wine, you name it, everything right here, guys. We wanna show you how to soak your Jamaican rum fruit cake and you know what I mean this 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 Christmas this Christmas I'm telling you this Christmas I'm telling you guys if if you think you're not gonna be at the cake you take a sad mistake you're gonna go in the kitchen because the way oh, I'm gonna show you how to soak your fruits yeah you have to go in the kitchen and you're gonna do some serious baking because honestly the recipe we are up for this seriously is amazing recipe amazing 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 recipe how to soak your fruits how to bake it and i'm gonna put a recipe below at this video on my youtube channel yeah how to simple simple sim i'm gonna put the recipe below how to simple bake a rest a cake at home or oh, do it then and stop the talking you're good. Yeah, but you know what I mean? Yeah, I know I need to do it, but, but I need more people to log on on the show because they're going to miss it and they're going to say, oh, Chef Ricardo, I did ask you all to do it and you didn't do it. Anyway, so first of all, you say, I'm talking, I'm, you say, stop the talking and do it. Well, thank you so much. But you know what I mean? It's a show. You have to talk and other S people listen. So we need more people on the show that before we say, okay. Because right now I'm getting a lot of text. People have been texting me and people have been saying, Yes, they're gonna log on and people are gonna do this and that people are gonna do that. Even on Facebook, now people have been texting and doing this. So I know you're saying I'm talking, stop the talking and do it, but listen to me now. I don't care what you wanna say, you know what I mean? I still respect you and I still you know what I mean you got a YouTube channel, God bless you, my brother. You know what I mean? I don't matter what you wanna say, we still love you. We show you our love to you the same way. I don't matter what you, you text your words, what you wanna say, we all is gonna have these kind of people in this world. And you know what I mean? We love you. You know what I mean? Thank you so much for all your words what you put forward to us. That we it is amazing to us. You know what I mean? It just build us more. We don't have any so right now. We want to start to show you guys how to, how to sort the fruits. But as I said, I got a few more people which I'm waiting on at the moment, which then you know, gonna um lag on, on the show and we're gonna show them. So, but basically these texts which is coming in, you know what I mean. You know what I mean? There's no need for people want to write certain kind of things on the show. You know the reason why they are writing it? Because there is something, them thinking negative. All right? All right. It, this is the other Jesus chat line. Okay. All right. God bless you, my brother. Yeah. If it's out of Jesus line, well, I'm telling you, you want to debate. So all you don't want someone to go on your show and talk certain kind of things. No, you want to like that. Now, so you must deal with love, peace, and happiness. Because coming in the future, I know for sure all of these things we're going to keep doing and typing up all these kind of things on YouTube. YouTube going to close it down. You need to watch the program of YouTube, man. You cannot do these things on YouTube. YouTube going to be closing them down soon. 
as they start to talk about certain things on YouTube, they're going to close on your account. So you have to be careful, mate. So, anyway, forget about you. You know what I mean? Because we are focused on, we are focused on and this fruits tonight, which we are talking about. We need to get the fruits to soak because there's a lot of people want to learn how to soak Jamaican rum fruit cake. If you're a Jamaican, you want to be talking that kind of way on the program like that. Because I got people watching the program all over the world. You want to be talking that kind of way. So, anyway, I still respect you, my brother. You know what I mean? Big up yourself, you know? And, you know what I mean? Keep up your show. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, thank you so much for that, man. <laughs> anyway, so, tonight, we want to talk about how we can soak your fruits all right so tonight is the night we get a lot of people like on the show a couple of days ago and was saying that they, they they like the show and we must always always keep up the show and i said to myself yes we're gonna do that because you know what i mean tonight is the night and it, some people read some people write and said chef ricardo can you show us life how to soak your fruits. Uh, <laughs> he said, hey, Ricardo, there was a tree outside my house. Funny happening. You're, yourself, they're so <laughs> good watching. All right, all right, my brother. Don't worry yourself, man. We love it. Respect for your Texas and you know what I mean? But you're still watching. That's brilliant. You know what I mean? And that's what we're talking about. <laughs> you're a brilliant, bro. Anyway, all right. But we are talking about we want to soak our fruits for Christmas, you know what I mean? But you have to be careful, brother, because, you know what I mean, there, there's coming a time now where YouTube going to be closing up so many accounts, you know. If, if, you, if you watch a program of YouTube or YouTube going on the other day, so you have to be careful when you watch it, you know what I mean? So, <laughs> yes, um, uh, this, 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 this Christmas, we know that a lot of people are going to be loving Loving this fruit, fruit cake, which we're gonna make, and also we have a lot of people who are gonna be happy about about you know what I mean this fruit soaking. So you know what I mean we are we are it's amazing. Anyway, it is a amazing recipe, and I'm gonna you know what I mean start the recipe in a couple of a minutes from now. Sorry guys, we're gonna start the show in a couple a minute. That's you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about. Anyway, remember we are saying that we got red label wine, which is one of the key red label wine, and also we got some Jamaican white rum. Jamaican white rum, basically, it is in every shop in London, every local shop supermarket you go, you can go walking and pick it up in any local shop in London. So, guys, as I can see exactly what I'm talking about right here, I got some. Glasses cherry. Um, some people call it American cherry and all them stuff, but you know what I mean? You can't get this cherry anywhere in the in, in the local shop in London, supermarket or anyway. Um I got some fruits, and this kind of fruits is just a fruit which um basically you can get this kind of fruits in any local shop, supermarket, you know what I mean? It's got every kind of fruits from cherries to you know what I mean, orange peel, every fruit or you can think of it. To make your Christmas cake so this is it right here and also I have some lovely raisin so it is amazing to know that we got all of the ingredients and basically right here I have some coconut rum coconut rum is good to use and you know what I mean soaking your fruits also some people don't use it but you know what I mean it's natural and it's just really really good we got some dark rum also we have some dark rum which we're gonna also put a cock of it inside of it and get it going on. It's brilliant, guys. It's brilliant. It's brilliant, you know what I mean? So, still waiting on two somebody to come and log on the show because I just text him and said, Chef Ricardo, I'm coming up. It's their problem, problem logging on, on the show, but I don't know what's the problem. It probably is YouTube. Anyway, remember you always have to have a container, which is a sealed container to put in your stuff inside of it. To make sure that you know what I mean when you seal it, it don't leak, no air get inside of it. I'm talking about like a jug like this. This kind of jug you can get them at any local shop, supermarket, or uh, ice street, the market, or you know what I mean. Um, 
anywhere you can get these kind of jugs to buy or if you have a jug at home which seal that's fine that's you know what i mean that's brilliant so um basically as you can see right here this is a little jug which can make a nice size fruit cake um i'm gonna show you how to sort the fruits and i'm gonna start the show now this is this is the the hot part of the show you know what i mean um you know what i mean a lot of people really want to see exactly what Chef Ricardo is all about and what I'm doing, um, what gonna happen. So basically, if I get my job, this is my job right here, guys. I'm not simply gonna just explain it to you as we goes along inside of the show right here. And I mean, as you can see, um, basically I have all of my ingredients right here. So we are ready, ready, ready to start to soak this fruit tonight. Are you ready to see exactly what Chef Ricardo is all about? Yes. First of all, as I said, this one is a mix, is a dry and cherry mixed fruit. This is a cherry mixed fruit right here. This is the 150 gram. Basically, if you're allergic to anything, guys, you need to read a package of these things, you know what I mean? To see if you're allergic to anything. Um, as I said before, you can go to any local shop, supermarket, and also look for the fruits area. You can get every kind of fruit we can think of in this world. So basically, this new one is a cherry mix fruit, and I'm basically gonna simply put roughly half of the 150 gram inside of this bottle right here. That's what I'm gonna do right now, guys. Make you guys can see half of it inside of the bottle. That's the first thing what you want to do. You don't want to put liquid first in the bottle. If you put liquid in the bottle, what's going to happen? You can't get to control it. Um, this one is the same thing, so we're not going to use that, that one. But this one is a different one. This one, which of every fruits what you can think of inside of this. They got the mixed peel. They got the orange peel. They got the cherries. They got the raisin. They got, the, they got every fruits what you can think of. And this fruit is all about, it said, mixed fruits. So you can, if it said mixed fruits, that means it got every single fruit inside of it. And as I said before, go to the shop or your supermarket, look and read the ingredients, read what's inside of it, guys. And also, go on the internet and type up and look for stuff. You can't go wrong. Um, basically, this is also 150 gram. Basically, if I remove the top of it just like this, and just put roughly half of it, 150 gram, half of 150 gram, inside of my bottle right here. Lovely and nice. This one is just some extra raisin. I brought this one, says extra raisin. I can add to it just to make sure I have enough fruits. So I'm gonna put this is 500 gram. So roughly, I might put quarter of it inside of it nice one lovely so that's the way how it goes right here all of the fruits is inside everything is inside of it um basically i got the red label wine ah the red label wine what i'm gonna simply do now i'm gonna pop some red label wine inside of it, like this just like this guys and i'm gonna put roughly half of it first after we put the half of it then next I got some white rum. This is a Jamaican red label wine. This one is very strong. I just brought a small bottle. Lovely. And I'm gonna put roughly half of it inside of it. And I'm gonna leave the rest of the half for when I bake my cake and mix it with some more red label wine. I got some Jamaican dark rum. I'm gonna pour some dark rum inside of it. Nice one. But I have some coconut rum. Coconut rum is really good. And I love coconut rum. It's strong, really nice. And I used it before and I said to myself, it's just brilliant. So I'm going to put right up to the top of the with the coconut rum. Nice and lovely. So basically, guys, as I can see right here, seal this. And also, you can put this somewhere safe for roughly two years. Or if you want to you wanna use it next year, Christmas 2016, it's up to you. Whatever you want to use it. But this is exactly what I'm talking about. You know what I mean? You seal it, put it down, and 
that's it. Put it down for two years, three years, and use it wherever you want to use it. Um, I did have some gloss cherry, but you don't have to put the gloss cherry inside of it. The gloss cherry can, when you're baking your cake, you can cut it up small and mix it inside of it, guys. But this fruit right here, you can leave this for roughly two, three years, and it will be fine. You can use it six months down the line, two months down the line, or even next day, you can use it because it's in 24 hours. You can also bake a cake. So guys, as I can see, exactly what I'm talking about. Remember, you can go to any local shop, supermarket, high street, and also say to them, you know what I mean, talk to any one of them, and you can get all of these fruits to buy. Very easy and simple. And you can make your Christmas rum fruit cake. If not, you know, if you don't want to use rum, there's other ways that you can use different kind of, you know what I mean, you got like fruit, wine, and all these things you can use to make your Christmas cake. Because I know a lot of people don't like alcohol and they want to make day fruits. So what I want to simply say to you, if you want me to do a video of that one, no alcohol, please let Chef Ricardo know. Um, you can also email me at chefricardocooking.com. So guys, it's, a, it's brilliant. It's really good and I'm happy I did it because a lot of people, they want to see, you know what I mean, if they miss it, and I know they will watch it on the YouTube channel. Uh, basically, I have so many people, you know what I mean, like the show and thank you guys for watching me tonight live showing you how to soak your fruits for Christmas. Hopefully this will be a benefit to someone, I don't know, but we're gonna make the cake and also we have a lot more stuff which we're gonna do. So thank you so much guys and hopefully you have a wonderful evening and look after yourself. This is from Chef Ricardo and the team and hopefully we will yeah, <laughs> do some more. Well, um, basically, you know what I mean, we, can do, we always can do more stuff. We always can do a lot more things, you know what I mean? Because there's a lot of people keep saying, Chef Ricardo, you need to do live show, live show, live show, live show. Um, remember, uh, so you can get my book on Amazon. You know what I mean? You can get my book on Amazon. The price, okay, you miss it. All right, because what happened now? You know what I mean? A lot of people, they will just say, I need to start the talk, you know, I need to start the show. But, you know what I mean, that's how I was waiting for some, you know what I mean, people to log on. But what I want to simply say to you, basically, you can go to any local shop, supermarket, and get fruits, dry fruits, raisin, all of these, mixed peel, peel, orange peel, all of these, all of those fruits, get them in a container, like this one, right here, as you see. Make sure you get some dark rum. Red label wine is the key. Red label wine is the most important thing. Make sure you get some Jamaican white rum. And also I have some coconut rum, which I did use. I got some glossy cherry, which also they use. But basically, I'm simply saying to you, you can go to any local shop, supermarket, and also you can get also some dry fruits. You use dry fruits, simple. And after you get your dry fruits, yeah, all you need to do is pour it into a bottle like this one right here because the bottle is a sealed bottle. This bottle can last up to two years without open it and do anything with it. But guys, as I said, as I said before, it is a it's brilliant. You know what I mean? Um, <laughs> make some jerk chicken. Anyway, I got a lot of jerk chicken recipe on my YouTube channel. Mate. I'm telling you, it's just brilliant at the moment. Jerk chicken. Tell it in a different kind of way, or for cook it, or for make it, or for make chicken grow, all sort of stuff with chicken. So, there's a lot of chicken recipe on the YouTube channel. If you go on my YouTube channel, there's a lot of jerk chicken recipe on it. Just to show you how I do it on the barbecue, in the oven, on top of the oven, in the grill, all over the whole place. So, there's no worry, no fuss. But if you want me to make it for you, I can make it for you. There's no problem. I'm always cooking chicken, mate. So, that's brilliant. I can make some jerk chicken for you because I have some chicken which I want to use up so I can do that one. I might do that one in the oven because outside is very cold at the moment and I don't want to stand up in the cold doing the jerk chicken. So, yes. Um, I, uh, but anyway, if you do not subscribe to the YouTube channel, guys, I want to say to you, you need to subscribe to the YouTube channel because, you know what I mean, you will, you will miss you know, a lot of stuff. You understand? If you subscribe to the YouTube channel, you will miss you, you won't miss anything, but if you don't subscribe, that's where it is. They can follow me also upon Instagram, uh, Chef Ricardo Cooking, 
Um, also on Twitter, Chef Ricardo, you can like my Facebook page, Chef Ricardo Cooking, which is going on really, really good. So, um, the dark rum, all right, some dark rum. Yes, I put just a little bit of the dark rum inside of it because I like my dark rum, you know what I mean? I like my red label wine, rum, you know what I mean? All these things, love dark coconut rum. These things is good for you to have in the kitchen, you know what I mean? Sometimes you feel sick or you feel bad. You know what I mean? You can use a little bit of rum and do something. So, guys, it's brilliant, you know what I mean? It's brilliant and, you know what I mean, hopefully this we will learn something new. If you missed the show, it's on the YouTube channel. It's going to be on the YouTube channel in the next 20 minutes time, which you can also re-watch it. You can watch it one more time and also you can, you know what I mean, do a lot of stuff with it. So, if you want me to show you how to make this simple little cake, because I have a cake which I'm supposed to make, coming up very soon um yes we're gonna you know what i mean yeah <laughs> i can taste the rum man taste the rum oh yeah uh, i love my rum i might take like uh let me see oh i might let's test the dark rum all right take a shot of the dark rum mm. ah. ah man <coughs> what i want to simply say <coughs> simply say to you guys <coughs> the rum is very good for you it's very good you know what i mean especially you know what i mean if you have cold or you're sick or anything, it's good, brilliant. Ah, man, mm. <laughs> good man. <laughs> you wanna try some of this rum? This rum is mad, man. This rum is not. <laughs> this rum is not plain. <laughs> anyway, tonight was a good evening, guys. And I don't know. Ah, oh, man, oh, it's very strong, very, very, very strong. So, um. As I said before, the show was a really good show, you know, maybe the other night when I was doing, talking about the Jamaican rum fruit cake, we have about almost, almost, you know, I mean, 12 to 13 people lock on, on the show, you know what I mean, because I started the show a couple of weeks ago, um, and I never, I never did finish it up, you know what I mean, and I said to myself, I need to finish up the show, because there's a lot of people like it, and a lot of people was giving me a lot of encouragement to say, Chef Ricardo, you need to come back and do the show. Um, you know what I mean? So that's where I'm at the moment. So we say, you know, then a few days ago, we start back the show by talking about how to soak your fruits. So right here, um, we was just talking about how to soak your fruits, guys. So hopefully this will be a, 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 a benefit to you. And you know what I mean? So what about your show tonight, guys? You need to text me and let me know. Write something in the thing and let me, my chef will kind of know what you think about the Jamaican fruits soaking because... You know what I mean? This is where most Jamaican people sort their fruits. Yes, we have to soak our fruits, you know what I mean? Make the fruits soak up for a couple of days. Yeah. Um, basically, as you can see, it's coming up to a late time at the night. Um, basically, we have a lot more stuff coming on up in the last couple of days time. You might, we might do another live show tomorrow in the day of what you can do at home. We want to talk about like roast beef and all them things that. Um, that which is next coming up, roast beef, Jamaican roast beef. We wanna do a talk show, um, but it's it's so many things, guys. So hopefully, you know, maybe this will be a benefit to you and speak to you guys one more time again on the show with Chef Ricardo, and hopefully this will be a benefit to you. Enjoy and share it, and you can always watch it one more time on the YouTube channel with Chef Ricardo. Thank you so much, and see you next time, guys. Bye bye. Have a wonderful evening. And if you're in a different country, have a great day, have a great time.